I'm speaking to you on Saturday evening after two intensely busy days. Legislative committees have been hard at work processing the resolutions, particularly those related to funding. My own Committee on Ministry has I processed 16 resolutions in the last two days. Tomorrow, Sunday, is the last day for including things in the budget. The budget will be printed on Monday and will be presented to both houses of the General Convention on Tuesday. So everyone has been working very hard to get any resolutions related uh, to the budget filed and sent to the secretariats of their, of their house. Legislation has also begun to move through the two houses. And like our federal system, both houses must approve identical resolutions for them to be adopted. And uh, because of our system, resolutions begin in different houses. So the other house is now beginning to see the work that the first house has done. In the House of Bishops today, we adopted the lay pension plan for the Episcopal Church. That will now go to the House of Deputies. Tomorrow is a Sabbath, and it's very much, I think, uh, in, uh, look, we're all looking forward to it very much. Uh, it will be a lighter day for us with worship in the morning and a short legislative session in the afternoon but much of the day will be free and more relaxed. We're also beginning the round of seminary and association dinners, which are part of the General Convention. Folks attend uh, lunches and dinners thrown by various organizations and groups to which they belong. Tonight was seminary night. Uh, Monday night will be class night for the House of Bishops. So we're beginning to see some of the fun festive events that are part of convention. Last night was the Integrity Eucharist, attended by something like 1,200 people, a gala affair, one that has grown every year, and featured last night the preaching of Barbara Harris. If you'd like to hear her sermon, you can get to it through the General Convention website, the Media Hub. We're all doing well here. We're all holding up. Uh, people are still smiling, and uh, we're looking forward to a day of rest and then back to work. Talk to you soon.